I find these planners, I want them to be so perfect that I find this whole process really quite overwhelming. You're looking at like 500 pounds worth of items. Hey team, welcome back to HGDC, HG Designs Crochet. I hope that you're tickety-boo, grab your Granny Square project and sit down with me. I have got so many cute things to show you. So, as you know, I've been taking a little bit of a break from like the social media side of HGDC and focusing a little bit more on what direction I want my life to go in and all of these huge massive decisions that have been going on behind the scenes and amongst all of that I have been crocheting so so much I cannot wait to show you the items that I have been working on like when I was pregnant with Teddy I was constantly told I would never have the time to crochet and that's just not been my reality thank god I will say that I haven't had the time to sit and write up the patterns that's a whole other issue for me i've had loads of time to crochet i've been making some of the cutest items seriously just would love to sit down and show them all now so because i've been working on so many items i was like right i need to write up these patterns and i need to get all the information together so that when i do have a little spot of time i can sit with my laptop get my mac out and get these written up so i started reaching for random bits of paper and i was like no 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 you have designed a planner specifically for this <laughs> so i have ordered new pattern planners and this vlog is a little bit of a unboxing and showing off products talking about the cost that's gone into stocking these products and all these other bits and bobs and when i was putting this video together i remembered that i had also recorded footage of me talking about and ordering the these planners back in like i think it was november ready for everybody to have them for the new year so I've put together the old footage and then I've put together the new footage which shows you what the brand new version, upgraded prestige version of these planners is and then there's just a little bit at the end of some of the projects that I've been working on and don't worry there is not a huge amount of crochet content within this, within this vlog but the next one Oh, the next one. So please enjoy watching behind the scenes. And I also will just add that the project that you see me currently working on here is one that I am now writing up in my new planner. Like it's such a full circle moment and I love it. Also, just a little bit of context for when you get to the new planner section. Um, I plopped down my camera and i was so excited that i just didn't stop to think about the angle so i have blurred out some of the image some of what you can see just for our location privacy and obviously i have blurred teddy's face because as soon as he saw my camera he wanted to have it of course he did and on top of that um the camera was plugged into my ring light and teddy is obsessed with cables and plugs so as soon as he saw that there was a cable off my ring light he wanted to plug it in so i have captioned everything that brad and i were saying when we did the like initial reaction to the planners and then you've got a little bit of teddy it's just real life babes it's real life enjoy made a decision that has risks attached to it um i when it came to ordering the minimum amount that i could order of the desk pads was 16 well the minimum was eight and i needed 11 so i had to order 16. so i decided that i was going to order 16 planners and make them into bundles to list on my website 
Now that's a risk because I've put every single penny from this pre-order into the planners. Whereas the original plan was that the revenue I made would help me get through a couple of months. So I made the decision that I was going to buy 16 of the planners and create bundles and list them on my website um, as like a one-off for my birthday. And I'm going to see how that goes and then I might do that again. I know that these planners are going to sell and I know that whoever receives them I'm really going to put them to good use. Um, but obviously when you when it comes to finances, it's not just me, it, it impacts my whole family. So yeah feeling i'm feeling i'm feeling it i've got 16 of these i can start sending these out now and i need to check the delivery of the glue pads the desk pads find out when they're arriving and also i'm waiting on the envelopes to arrive as well so i want to just post on instagram do an update to everyone and just message everyone on etsy as well that's ordered so they know where they are with things and I've got another thing to un to open as well. I need to check when my postcards are arriving because I, I send a print and a bookmark with every planner order as well. I put an order in with Amazon. I got some more of this, which is what I put in my bags. It's a plastic mesh that I use to reinforce my bags and I have some bag designs that I want to make. So I put some of my remaining revenue into this. The other thing that I put some of my revenue into is an item for a couple of designs that I have in mind. And that's these clips. How do I open it? <laughs> it must be nice to do this, right? I don't know how you open them. Um, these are like if you're american then you'll know it as a pacifier clip or in the uk a dummy clip or it's like a suspender clip um i want to make teddy some dummy clips we have a couple that we use i'd like to be able to swap them so they match his outfits um and also i want to use them so that i can make a string to clip them onto my mittens so that when I have to take them off, when I'm walking the dog, I don't have to try and put them in my pocket. Like I can just let them go and they're still gonna be attached to me. And it also means that when I go to put my coat on, I don't have to try and find them. And the same for Teddy's mittens um, and a couple of other design ideas that I've got. Oh, okay, you literally just pull it. So that will clip onto the dummy or the mittens and I'm going to crochet and attach. So I put some of my revenue into that as well. I might make matching, like as a freebie, I might make matching dummy clips for the blankets that I've been making. I just need to make sure that I put like a disclaimer in there to just be careful like you don't wrap it around your baby the baby doesn't get it wrapped around their neck and you know all those sorts of things things that you would think would common sense but you would hate for something to happen just because you didn't mention it so yeah I got a whole bag of them I probably only needed 10 so I best find some uses for them I might be able to use them in bags and things as well so You're looking at like 500 pounds worth of 
items. I bought 16 planners, 16 desk pads. I bought some new postcards. I got the plastic mesh, the dummy clips, and some envelopes, some stickers, some packing labels. I find these planners, like, I want them to be I want them to be so perfect that I find this whole process really quite overwhelming. I know it's all going to pay off. I'm seriously debating whether to reduce my Instagram schedule so that I'm only posting three times a week. And YouTube, I want to do every week and then I get frustrated because I can't keep up with it and then I just stop. So every two weeks is better than nothing. Now I need somewhere to store planners. I need somewhere to store stock. They've come out really nice. Why is it wonky? They've come out really, really nice. I'm gonna get that printed and that printed framed. I'm gonna have a picture wall in here. Okay. Oh. I'm so nervous about this one. This could be like one of those pivot moments in my business where I don't look back or I've just wasted 30 quid. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. This is, this is it, this is the one. It feels so nice, so good. <gasps> the paper feels really nice. That's it. I won't be going back. Oh, so good. 
all the pages work. I've made the mistake on that page. Never mind. Never mind. So I realised that I'd done a typo. I've put two in there twice. And I changed it on here and I forgot to change it in there. Oh, hang on. So this is the first version and this is the second version. And I put the year on the spine as well. The spirals were really annoying me. They get bent out of shape. And although it does mean that the thing opens completely flat, um, I don't like carrying it around with me. I love carrying this around. I already know I haven't even carried it around. I've got to go show Brad. <sighs> Look at me with my own products. I've been debating whether to stop doing phys physical products because of space to store them and this, that, the other, but I'm so drawn to this. Like, I really want to continue with this. Let's go show Brad. Brad? Yeah. I had a delivery. Mama. Hey, babes. So this is the old one. Mama. Oh, you made me food with a pink plate. This is the old. Yeah, and then this is the new. It looks so much more prestige. It does. I'm really happy. Pad. 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 Want to look? Yeah. Uh, we'll have to find one. Can you go look in your grey basket? Yeah. No. What are you doing? Yeah, they're, they're just annoying me and I can create a little cover for that. They are more expensive, but I just think it's nicer for it. They're so pleased with it. Pad. Yeah, that's a Okay, then difference. take it to the... For the... For again. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, but I feel like I've just leveled it up. Stuff. We've got power lead just there. Did it? Yeah, it's got the light on it. Yes. So that means there's power. Oh! Now you can read your paper. Yes. I'm really happy with it. Alright, today and the new photo arrived today. I'm really, 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 really enjoying this time to myself. I've had snacks, I've had crochet time, I've had the TV all to myself to watch exactly what I want. And also, I had my foot spa on and oh, I just want to continue sitting here and getting on with this design. It's coming together really well. Uh, and just, I just want to carry on. However, it is almost midnight. My new self-imposed bedtime is that I need to be upstairs by 11. I have stretched that out a bit because Teddy's woken up twice and I've been up to sell him. I don't want to push it anymore, so I'm going to quickly tidy up. And then, yeah, hopefully I'll get a little bit of time in the morning to do a little bit more. I don't want to stop.
Hold it up then. Ooh, what do you think? Oh, Cute, lovely, beautiful. What do you think? Daddy. Dad, I left you. Hey, <laughs> feet don't go on Granny Squash. Get them toes off my work, pesky rab rab. Yeah, it can. Yeah, put your, put your hands on it. Pick it up and show me the beautiful colours. Ooh, what do you think? A bubble. 10 out of 10? Yeah. Yeah.